this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy Mystic Quest! Since last time, I cleared out all, or, well, maybe not all the monsters, but most of the monsters remaining in the dungeon, so that way, you know, we can just get right to the end. We're almost done with this place anyway. Man, these mushrooms are looking really stale to, uh, you know, chop down like that and make a sound like that, you know? Then again, these mushrooms are huge! Man! By the way, with those oozes that we met up with earlier, even though they're weak to bombs, what I would actually recommend doing with Benjamin is using the Dragon Claw on them, because then you can get them stoned, and that way uh, you might be able to kill them in one shot, you know? Otherwise, you know, you're pretty much going to have to rely on physical attacks anyway, and between Benjamin and Kaylee, with almost any two weapons, you'll be able to uh, well, kill them in two shots. So, there you go. It's too bad the sword isn't more useful in the game, you know? I mean, you use it to open doors, like the, the tree and stuff like that. But I mean, you know, the sword is like, you know, your prototypical hero's weapon, you know? You, you gotta have the sword being useful. And here, it was useful for, well, the level forest, and I think like one floor of the ice pyramid before you got something that was flat out better than it. You know, how could they do that? So, anyway, uh, where do I, how do I get out of here? I'm trapped! No! Well, let's see if I can find a secret. Well, not a secret passage, but, uh... Well, a secret. Why? Or whatever those things are. What is the, the technical term for those things that I'm hooking on to? I don't know. But anyway, yeah, we're on the last floor here, so we're almost done with this place. Yay, more heal potions. Well, these guys can uh, uh, use uh, Confuse on you. Those uh, Sculptures, they, um, what is it? They can use that Doom Touch on you, can't they? I never saw them use it when I was clearing them out, but I, I thought they could. Well, who's that guy? Hey, he looks dangerous. I'm going to uh, sk skedaddle right past him. Oh, okay, I guess I have to uh, fight him there. Well, how about I give you some head? For boss time! Er, wait a minute. Never mind. Anyway, these guys are all weak to win, including Gidra. So, first things first, uh, just use it on all of them. You'll be able to kill the Skulgers that way. Yeah! Kick ass! Two down, one to go. I don't think it matters whether it's multi-targeting or single-targeting when you hit the enemy. Unlike Final Fantasy II! Yeah, for some reason, if you multi-target a spell on one enemy, doesn't it still suffer from the split damage formula or something like that? Nuts. Okay, yeah, we might want to uh, heal up Kaylee there. Ow! Shouldn't this guy be like a... What is it? Like a... Well, not a, not a Cerberus, but a... A Chimera, isn't it? The guy with the goat's head and all that. I don't know. Gidra just sounds like a weird name. I don't know. But anyway, yeah, let's heal up there. I think Kaylee still has a better magic stat than I do. Nuts! You actually killed me! Okay, well, I guess I gotta... Re no! Oh, whew! I'm immune to it. Ha-ha! Gidra looks like a name that's spelled backwards for something. I, I don't know. It just looks like one of those names that's like... That can't possibly be a real name. It's like... They took some, I, I don't know, one of the designers for the game and turned his name backwards, like Noob Saibot or something like that. I, I don't know. All right, we almost got him. You can do it! Or maybe not. Ow. Man, this guy's wailing on me with his wind spell. How is that supposed to hurt anyone? Anyone? I mean, maybe a monster in the air when you're flying and it might disorient you or something like that, but... Well, we got him all the same. Hooray! Yeah, we killed all of them. I don't know that you have to beat all of them. I think you just have to beat Gidra, and that's it. But, uh, all right, there we go. Thank you for carrying me on your gigantic penis. Yeah, you see in the background there? Uh, I don't know what it was saying back there. It said something. But, like, the trees were forming a word, kind of like in, uh, the last Star World in Super Mario World, you know? But, uh, no, I want to see what it was saying. Game? Come on. Nuts! I can't see what they were saying. 
Oh, well. Well, maybe I'll take a look at it later off screen or something. Let's see what's going on around here. Oh, hey, it's that old guy again. Did you get some of your goddamn tea? Okay. What prophecy? Why don't you tell me the pro the prophecy, Mr. Godlike Smarty Pants? Eh, whatever. But anyway, we can go through a secret passage here. There we go. Let's see, just gotta wiggle my way around through here. Nothing! Thanks, game. Thanks a whole bunch. Okay, well, we could go over here and uh, take care of these battlefields, but uh, I think... Yeah, you know what? Let's do the battlefields next. Well, there might be something I could buy at uh, Windia up there, so... Yeah, yeah, we'll go to Windia first. Hey, how's it going? Wow, seems pretty windy around here. Uh, no, no, I haven't seen anyone named Norma. Abby Norma? No, no, just kidding. But, uh, sure, we'll buy a Cupid Locket. Ah, yes, this is why I wanted to come here first. Now I remember. I thought you got this thing from a battlefield there, but, uh, you get the Cupid Locket, you are immune to Confuse. Yes. Oh, thank goodness. Confusion is, like, one of the very few status ailments that might actually be able to kill you in the game. But not anymore. Yeah, all right. Yeah, probably one of my favorite accessories in the game. Well, of course it is. It's the last one. Anyway, uh, let's see. Yeah, I could use a rest up at the end. Why not? Sure. I don't think I can buy anything else for the remainder of the game now that I think about it. Oh, and we get a complimentary heal potion and refresher while we're here. All right. Just gonna loot the fridge as long as I'm staying at the hotel. Thanks a lot. What'd you get? Oh, just cure potions. Yeah, I've got plenty of those. I keep on forgetting to use my cure potions, but oh well. Hey, they got a little uh, chocobo weather vane up there. That's a nice little touch. Let's see what else is going on around here. Uh, nothing over there. Hey, how's it going? Otto? Otto Octavius? No. No, that's someone else. Rainbow Road, huh? Oh no, not that. Horrible Mario Kart memories are coming back! No. No, that was something. That's, well, yeah, that was pretty bad. Oh, no! So, we can't make the Rainbow Road because of the wind. That's the problem you want me to solve, game. Um, okay, I'll try to stop passing wind if I can. But anyway, down here we get a heal potion. All right. Man, they must take advantage of uh, a lot of wind power around here, huh? Well, it's nice to know that they're environmentally conscious around here. Let's see what's going on up there. Uh, oh, there's nothing up there. You could, uh, hook shot over there, but, uh, Nah, nah, nothing interesting up there. Yet. I don't know why they let you go up there, but... Well, I suppose it's kind of nice, I guess. Eh, whatever. But I like how they have the Chocobo reference there. That's a pretty nice touch. Hey, how's it going? Oh. Yeah, the, the wind! It's too horrible! It's... It... I get wind burn! As, a uh, that, that is a drawback to the Bailey Curse. We're, ac we're actually very susceptible to wind burn. Our ears will get really red if uh, we stay out in uh, windy, well, if it's really windy outside. It, it, we, our ears turn red because of wind burn. I'm serious! Oh, okay, well, yeah, we, well, I've got enough seeds anyway, so just ask Kaylee. Oh, yeah, we can't get that yet. Hmm. Oh, well. Uh, oh, yeah, this is where the, uh, yeah, the dock is. We don't have the Mobius crest. That's the last crest there. So we'll get that soon enough, viewers. Soon enough. But anyway, yeah, we got to. Uh, well, we got to go somewhere. We got to save Norma up to the north there. But we can't go up there yet. So what I'm going to do is, uh, well, first things first. Let's uh, clear out those battlefields back there. I'll clear out everything except one enemy in both of them, and then I'll show you what we can get from them. Okay, I cleared out both of these battlefields here, so let's start with the easier one over here. Now here you can run into basically the same enemies you could in the giant tree there. Uh, Sculptures or oozes. That's all that I'm going to put in this battlefield, so there you go. And by the way, you could just go back to the giant tree there if you really wanted to, but I don't. 
Oh, and I looked up that message that they were spelling out in the trees there. I looked it up in the video after recording that first segment. Uh, it said either Goon Kid or Go On Kid. Now why it says that, I don't know, but... Anyway, we got 2,800 experience playing that battlefield. Awesome. Now for the last battlefield in the game. Now here, this one will require Kaylee to go first in order for everything to go smoothly. Uh, the vampire over there is weak to win. Yes! All right, got him. So you do that, and then you use meteor on the other two, and then you're all set. The uh, water hags are weak to fire, but... I can't one-chat them with it, so it doesn't work too well. So I just prefer using Meteor! And for clearing out this battlefield, we just get a whole bunch more experience. All right, well, there we go. So that's all the battlefields in the game. Speaking of Meteor, I was recently playing uh, Final Fantasy IV in the uh, PSP Complete Collection. The Meteor spell, when Tella uses that on Golbez, that was epic. This chest is not epic there. That's... But yeah, it's just amazing what they're doing with the graphics, even though it's still 2D, you know? So I like that, but the way they, uh, it, they made it like Supernova in Final Fantasy VII. I mean, he was that good there. But can we stop the wind from Mount Gale? Or will we be the ones passing wind? Find out next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy Mystic Quest! This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day!